I think my autofocus is actually working, so like, go me honestly. Hi guys, it is Saturday, so that means boom, boom, I'm filming another bin haul video. I feel like I need like a Harry Potter one, like, you know? I don't know, maybe not. I'm filming another bin haul or bin voyage haul. I got some things on 50 cent day and I got some things on $5 day so I thought that I would share them with you guys. So this Friday was rough you guys. I definitely had a lot like harder time finding good stuff for 50 cents. I'm still excited because you know 50 cents like even if you go and only find like two or three things like it's worth it um, in my opinion. I got a few things nothing super crazy honestly. Um, a little different, but it's okay. So I'm going to show you guys what I got for 50 cent day. So the first thing is this pair of earrings. Now these were originally $20 and it was a set of two, but they are this super, super classy. So for one pair of earrings for 50 cents, I don't think it was that bad. Definitely going to scrub these in alcohol before I wear them, but... Super excited about that. I found a set of grips for the Joy-Cons um, for the Switch. This was a jackpot to me because I love these. I think that they're awesome. I especially love these super, super thick ones. These are so comfortable when you're playing like good RPGs and stuff on the Switch. These are amazing. And the fact that there's two sets of them in here and then there's also these smaller ones. So you guys can kind of see the thickness that I'm talking about. Also got this thumb grips pack. It's designed for the Xbox One, but I'm gonna see if I can put them on my PlayStation controller because I actually have a matching green silicone case on my PlayStation controller. So I was gonna see if these are gonna work on it. Obviously there's only one set. A set is missing. Uh, not sure what happened there. But for 50 cents, I still think it was worth it. They sell like the name brand sets of these and two of them is like $14 at GameStop, which is ridiculous. That's what it looks like. It was opened. These retail for $5. It was on clearance for $2.50 and it did not sell. But this is the package. And then um, it came with Nagini, which is Voldemort's snake. And I think that it's just so dope. These aren't by Funko or anything. I'm not sure who necessarily makes these but I have seen them at Target before and I've always been intrigued by them but it is the snake. I like it. I think it's different. I might put this on my switch case actually. I love having keychains on my switch case. Uh, my cousin has one of these for her van and I thought it was the coolest thing um, so I've always wanted one and the last bit I went through it was just sitting there and it is this and it's got the clip on the back right here and it is a trash can for your car so you clip it on like the cubby on your car door and then you can just throw your trash like in here and then when you get home you can open it and empty it in your garbage at home we got two screen protectors this is the iPhone XS Max and then this is the iPhone 8 and 7 Plus, which is what his, Brandon's little brother has. So I got these for him because I know that he said that if we found these on 50 Cent Day, he wanted one. So I found him a set, so I have that for him. I need to keep that separate. And then this actually fits my phone, and I wasted like two or three of the screen protectors that we had um, putting them on my phone. Ooh, these are thick. These are nice. But there's uh, two of these in here. How I got those microphones on $5 day, they had some leftover, um, like boxes, like everywhere, just boxes. And I found the bag and I found some things that go in it. I did not get the microphone, but I did get the accessories. So the extra muff, the um, adapter, there's actually two adapters that I have here, and I got two more muffs as well. And another little pouch. For 50 cents, I think that this was worth it to have, 
just to have the extras and I can use these because this is the mic that was like all set up for the camera and then there was the one that was like made for like portable devices so I can use these with the portable one so super excited about that. I got another pair of earrings. These were originally $7.99. They were on clearance for $2.38 and they did not sell but they are from Target and they are these super dope chains. It's like a gold chain link and then a clear one and then a gold one and then a clear one. And I think that they look really freaking dope. I think these would be sick with an outfit. I got some eyelash tweezers. I have some false eyelashes. I'm not typically the one that wears like eyelash, fake eyelashes. I've never actually worn them before. But I have a few really fun sets for like if we have any like cool concerts that I think they'd be appropriate for. And I was like, I don't even know how to apply these. And I was like, I think there's tweezers and stuff for them. So when I saw these for 50 cents, um, they're probably honestly only worth 50 cents. I was like, I need to grab those. I got a another phone case. This is a clear one and it's a really thick plastic. Like it's really, really nice, really, really sturdy. And it has sort of like this black accent on the sides, like these bumpers. I think that it looks really, really dope. And then for my cousin, I have to clean these. She collects Mickey Mouse and I found these and I know that they have these sets at Target. I was only able to find two of the measuring spoons. I'm going to really clean them um, with Clorox wipes and then wipe them down. But I don't think she's going to actually use them. I think she's just going to keep them in her china cabinet. But they are Mickey Mouse measuring spoons and I think they were originally like a set of four and I'm not quite sure how much they retailed for at Target. But this one is one tablespoon and this one's a one fourth tablespoon. Camera strap for my camera and it's this really pretty floral one. I got a switch um, steering wheel. It's this highlighter pink. These are like the Amazon Basics brand I think. Um, we had this set and then my dog decided to use one of them as a chew toy so we only have one. So I got another one, but I don't know if I'm going to keep it and use it because we really don't use these. Or if I'm going to give it to my friend because all she has is one set of Joy-Cons. So this would probably be way more convenient to use for her. And this is 50 cents. Now, not my cup of tea, but I do know that this album just came out. Like, it's, it's brand new. I know that it was not received well at all. <laughs> But I was like, for 50 cents, I'm going to scrub it and maybe somebody will pay $5 for it. It is cracked, but that's okay. But it is Liam Payne's debut album. So that's all that stuff. Now, for $5 day, which was today, we did not hit like any really big jackpots. Um, there were a lot of people that did, they had the new Star Wars game, somebody got an iPhone X, I think there was more AirPods, there was microwaves, there was like the or Orchek, Orjek, Oric, Oric vacuums, the like $400 vacuum. We just got these like little things. So I figured I would show you guys what we got. We got a reusable pet fur remover. Brandon has been wanting one of these for a while now. He's talked about it. I'm not sure how much these are worth or anything, but I know that we're going to use it, so it literally doesn't matter. Oh, this thing's awesome. This is great. Um, we got a integrated protective case for the Nintendo Switch. These are usually like eight to twelve dollars on Amazon, so not too crazy of a good price. There's some different color variants. Um, but this one is the black one and it's not broken or anything, but we don't have anything like this for the main switch. I got a light sensing countdown timer. Um, this is a Philips brand, brand new inbox. This is, um, we're going to use this for our inflatables. We have a few Christmas inflatables and we always have to unplug them and plug them in. So this is awesome because we can just put the timer on or we can just switch it on and off even. That's a lot easier than having to pull the thing out. So this is great. I bought this because I might try and sell it. It's a Homder digital voice recorder. These go for $35 on Amazon, brand new, um, but it's in the box. 
and it has even like the slip here and then this is the voice recorder oh it feels nice might try and flip this for like 20 bucks or something but that would pay me back for everything that I bought today so it'd be worth it so I found the pop socket pop grip so it's the phone grip and stand with swappable top so then you can go ahead and pop the top off so that's what these are and this one's really pretty it's got poinsettias on it this will be so cute for Christmas I also found this and this is another it's got the pop socket on it and it's got a top and it's got this keychain little gaudy um, not something that I would be crazy about it's actually a llama with a sloth on it so the sloth is riding the llama which is super fun and then this is like a really cool pastel galaxy one Brandon like that one so maybe he'll put it on one of his phone cases and then <laughs> I also found a pop mount. <laughs> I've been wanting something to put my phone in um, on my car for a while and I never really thought like how pop socket would affect that um, if it would work or not so when I saw this I was like oh hell yeah so this is awesome um, I actually really really like this you can do so many different things like you can put it down like this when you're not using it and then when you're going to use it you can have it up like this um, and all you do is slide your phone in it so now I have this because I got Bluetooth in my car um, and I've been needing something you know a little a little extra so I have been wanting a car mount so that way I could just set my phone and since um, I have the ability to just tap the screen and then it turns on and then I can hit like skip the song I think it's a lot safer than having to like reach over and try and find my phone in the passenger seat and pull it and look at it these are a Target brand but it's this really big uh, set of curtains these are 52 inches by 96 inches which is bigger than the standard I think the standard uh, curtain size is like I think my mom was saying like 45 or 52 so these are really long curtains and we have a really huge window in our dining room and we want to put these in there um, so they're really nice they're like this creamy color and they have this white tooling over the top is everything that we got from the bin place so definitely not our best haul yet but yeah, if you guys keep liking these videos, I'm going to keep them coming because I love getting this stuff. I am crazy for a good deal, so. I love you guys, and I'll see you again very, very soon. Peace out, Girl Scouts.